Hola. Mm, welcome to the weekly vlog of Bike Goals. Today we are here for talking about We Are Traffic. We Are Traffic is the motto of um, a movement uh, started by cyclists, but then followed by all kind of, of people that wanted to reclaim, reclaim the streets and the roads for vehicles that are not with a, a motor, like a car or a motorbike. Or hmm. I made these signs because um, when I first met this uh, slogan and this uh, message, I researched a little bit. Actually, I, I wrote a, a post in Bike Goals about that. It was for me very interesting to, to make other kind of vehicles uh, visible and reclaiming the street as public for everybody, not only for cars, you know, like a, especially in the cities, that is the huge problem. And I thought that I would like to do a sign because this long trip that we are doing in the bike is really uh, make me think about how how fragile you are in the road and how some cars they don't they don't appreciate uh, this vulnerability that you might have. The message would be that if you don't uh, ride a bike, it would be nice that you take. Because uh, the people that drive cars and also ride a bike, they don't need this message because they know. They know what does it mean to bike in a road with cars and, and they are respectful already. But a lot of drivers, they are not respectful and they are not sensitive about how vulnerable you feel and how fragile you are in a bike, especially in roads. When we, you travel with a, with a bike, you mostly uh, choose less traffic roads. Uh, that means that the roads are not sometimes well maintained, so the sides are full of holes and bumps. It's not easy to ride a bike in a very narrow place on the side, destroyed sometimes. And if you add wind and rain, or you are going uphill, it's more difficult. And sometimes some drivers they don't understand that we are maybe two hours riding already when they pass through us. Uh, so they need to think that it's not easy and they have to keep the distance. And the, and the, and the safety distance is not a meter, it's much more. Because if something happens, you meet a hole or you have a, a little distraction that it's not uh, dangerous for, for, uh, for you, but if it's passing, passing a car, it's very dangerous because you can make a turn, the car passes, and you are done. That's it, because you are very fragile in a bike. So they don't take into consideration that it's like us, for example, uh, we are bikers. And in a lot of countries that they don't use the bike a lot, the sidewalks are shared with pedestrians. It's the same for us. You don't go super fast close to a pedestrian. You go slow and a lot of distance. Why? Maybe you control the bike, but you don't want to scare people. You don't want to make them feel unsafe because the road, the streets are for everybody. Doesn't matter how fast and how strong you are. Unsafe and unsafe and I feel it's dangerous biking a bike and makes me, uh, it takes away all the joy that is biking a, ride, a, a bike and, and, and be outside and feeling the wind, nature, it takes away that. You cannot enjoy anything, just be very, very tense looking that you are in these centimeters and always straight, even if you find a hole or whatever, it doesn't matter. So it's very stressful and you feel tense. And yeah, it's how I feel. And it's like 
you are nothing on the road, like you are like a fly on the window shield. It's, it's not fun. No, I don't know, like I would like uh, more consciousness, more awareness for everybody. Car drivers, bike riders too, because sometimes <laughs> cyclists are a little bit crazy uh, with pedestrians, like everybody uh, take into account that we are together and we are the same uh, in the roads, in the streets, whatever. So more sensitivity, more awareness and more love. That is, that is in our words.